Ajay started a business with an investment of rupees 48,000. After T months, Bimal joined him with an investment of rupees 48,000. And after another T months, I am stressing on the word another here. After another T months, Chanchal joined them both with an investment of rupees 24,000. If at the end of the year, the profit share of Ajay was equal to the sum of the profit shares of Bimal and Chanchal, find the value of T. Find the value of T. So interesting question. Ajay is the one who started the business, invested 48,000. After T months, Bimal joined with 48,000. After another T months, after another T months, Chanchal joined them both with an investment of 24,000. So we know their investments very clearly and the times that they have spent. I mean, not in terms of the magnitude but yeah there's an equation in terms of t that we have right then at the end of the year at the end of one year the profit share of ajay was equal to the sum of the profit shares of bimal and chanchal right sum of bimal and chanchal so find the value of t find the value of t is the question now how do you calculate profit you know that profit is proportional to the investment and period of investment period uh, is investment and duration of investment i mean we have discussed this basics in the partnership topic right so let's calculate the profit ratio ajay is to bimal is to chanchal let's say the profits are abc so profit of ajay is to profit of bimal is to profit of chanchal will be in what ratio investment 48000 into 12 months see ajay's investment is there in the business for 12 months he started the business and he was there till the end so he made an investment of 48000 for 12 months bimal bimal invested 48000 but only for 12 minus t months see he joined t months late after t months so in the period of one year, he was absent for the first T months. So 12 minus T months. His investment of 48,000 was available only for 12 minus T months. E's to finally Chanchal, 24,000. For how many months? See, Chanchal joined after another T months. Already T months have passed when this fellow Bimal joined. Then after a gap of another T months, Chanchal joins. So Chanchal has lost how much of time? Two T months. T months and T months. Two T months. So Chanchal was there in the business only for 12 minus two T months. You understand her investment of 24,000 was made use for only 12 minus 2t months that's it you're done simplify this first 24 is common so 2 times and 2 times so what do we have overall 2 into 12 is 24 is to 2 into 12 24 minus 2t is to this is 12 minus 2t so that's the profit ratio the ratio of the profit should be 24 is to 24 minus 2t is to 12 minus 2t a is to b is to c now, since the total profit is not given to us, we will not be able to calculate the individual values. But then what we know is the share of Ajay. What is the share of Ajay? 24 parts is equal to the sum of the profit shares of Bimal and Chanchal. Bimal's share is 24 minus 2t parts and Chanchal's share is 12 minus 2t parts. So basically, the equation given to us is Ajay is equal to Bimal plus Chanchal. Substitute that 24 parts is equal to 24 minus 2t parts plus 12 minus 2t parts. Simplify what happens, 24 gets cancelled on both the sides, 2t and 2t, 4t, 4t is equal to 12, so t is equal to 3 and there ends the matter and don't try to elaborate it by writing all these steps, I'm sure you know one step can be cut down, at least one step can be cut down, which is, which is that step, tell me, this step number 3, a equals to b plus c, don't waste your time, yeah. So do the calculation, get the answer is 3 months, answer is 3 months, right? Find the value of t, the value of t is 3 months, option, whichever option it is, 3 months, yeah?